The Institute of Spiritual Education Africa is proposing the 24th of July as a national day of sacrifice in order to tackle insecurity. It believes such a day is needed if Nigeria is to make meaningful progress. Our senior correspondent Ivy Kanu reports. Many lives have been lost in the last 10 years of ongoing conflict in the northeast part of Nigeria. The continued violence by Boko Haram and its splinter groups has claimed thousands of civilians, with millions forced to flee their homes. In that order, we're going to offer a sacrifice. Because the Institute of Spiritual Education in Africa says the bloodshed can be stopped if the lives lost are appeased by the government. We are not going to continue like this. Enough of bloodshed. That's why I tell you, in northern Nigeria, we need a higher sacrifice to silence the blood of men who are crying for vengeance. There's no place in the world if the blood is slaughtered and the ground swallow the blood. There's a voice of the blood of man and the only thing they can speak is vengeance. And as I said, there's commotion in Nigeria. The Institute wants all Nigerians, irrespective of tribe or religion, to be ready to sacrifice to put an end to the bloodshed in the country. There's a sacrifice that Nigerians need to offer to God, even if it's once in a year. It's in the Bible where we come together. The elders of the country will come. That's what they call the seat of elders. The president is going to be there. So we'll be able to come together as a nation and hand over the country to God. That's what I'm going to propose that we're going to have one day. We call national sacrifice day. The promoters believe no political party will be able to end insecurity in the country until this spiritual call is obeyed. Ivy Kano, TVC News, Lagos.